Jose Zaleta, Molo, Iloilo City, November 23, 1889 to December 6, 1972, was a Philippine lawyer and politician. He was elected as Senate President for a brief period in 1953. Career During the Japanese occupation Zaleta was accused of collaboration, along with Jorge Vargas, Jorge Bocobo, and Manuel Roxas, being the first to respond to General Homa's order to form an executive commission. After the establishment of the Philippine Republic in 1946, the Department of Interior was restored and Zaleta was appointed by President Manuel Roxas once again to head the agency until 1948. Zaleta S term was marked by heightened tensions with the Hukbalahap movement, with Zaleta instituting a pass system that was required of central Luzon residents wishing to travel outside their towns. Like his mentor Roxas, he adopted a hard-line attitude toward the Hux, declaring in 1947 that the Hux faced only two choices, surrender or annihilation. He gave carte blanche to the Philippine Constabulary and all their operations against dissidents. He was in charge of negotiating several times with its leaders, including Luis Lava, Luis Tarek, Juan Felio, and José de Leon. In 1946 Zaleta was elected as Speaker of the House of Representatives in the inaugural session of the Congress. He became Senator 1951 -1957, and was briefly elected the Senate President in 1953. He became Provincial Governor of Iloilo in 1959. During the Marcos regime, he was made the presidential consultant on local government. He is among the few Filipinos included in the World Biography, 1948 edition and in the International Who's Who, 1952 edition. Zaleta was married to Soledad B. Ramos. Library work After his stint in journalism, Zaleta returned to academic work and focused on librarian tasks. He traveled the world and met famous collectors including Wenceslao Retana. He collaborated with bibliographers and historians such as James Alexander Robertson and Emma Helen Blair who needed references for work such as the Philippine Islands, 1493-1898. He also visited Spain to study the 1887 Exposición General de Filipinas, and Cambridge to study the vocabulario Tagalo. In Manila, he created archives and texts to collate the various historical sources for creating the Philippines' history, using both local and foreign sources. References List of Iloilo First District Representatives Philippine Senate bio of Jose C. Zaleta, the first parts of which have been erroneously conflated with the life of the bibliographer Clemente Jose Zaleta, 1876-1904, December 24, 2009. Department of Interior and Local Government History, accessed December 24, 2009. William Pomery, The Philippines, pp. 117 and 153, accessed on December 24, 2009. Benedict Kirkley, The Huck Rebellion, p. 189, 190, accessed on December 24, 2009.